please tell me you jumped. I love it when I can scare a man. So, what would you like me to do for you, Mr...? Chris. So, Christopher, it's £90 for a couple of hours in here, or for £190, you can do whatever you like. I'm here to talk. Well, I wasn't expecting a saint at this time of night. I can't go to a priest because I'm not religious. I can't go to the old bill because I haven't done anything wrong. And I certainly don't plan on visiting a stinking psychiatrist because I ain't fucking crazy. I mostly get married men coming in through this door. I married Trish six years ago. I got her pregnant, so... No way my dad would have accepted Barsis in the family. You Romeo, you. When Daniel first came into our lives, things weren't as... Well, let's just say I wasn't over the moon. begging to sleep with us in the middle of the night because he was scared. So I sent him to his room, but a nasty piece of work got his revenge. I cried all night. Trisha was begging me to switch on the night when she bought him. What was he scared of? No son of mine was going to be a fucking wuss. So I gave him a beating. As I got in the room, he started screaming. There's a monster in here, Daddy. Over and over and over again. I sorted him out, though. Daddy! 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 I thought the little shit was throwing a tantrum. When I got there... When I got there... He was dead on the floor, eyes wide open and glassy like, lying in a pool of blood. What a mess. The stain never came out. I take it you didn't regret it then? I didn't kill him. The kid had a fit of rage. He must have, because he couldn't get his own way. He was thrashing about. He must have landed on his head, slipped hard. That's what the police think happened. That's what I thought. So you don't think that's what killed him? At the time I did. Now I know who killed him. What he was supposedly scared of. It was the devil. Look, I don't have much time. You can't seriously expect me to believe that. I didn't kill him. Okay, let's say it was the devil. 
if it was the devil. Why you? There has to be a reason. Don't have much time. It's going to cost you extra. What the fuck are you talking about? Don't like it? There's the door. <laughs> Speak of the devil and he shall appear. What? Haven't you heard that saying before? If you convince yourself of something, it starts to come true. Well, in your head anyway. That's why I'm charging you extra. I can't risk letting that sort of thinking in here. I have money to make, you know? Fuck you. So, something supernatural killed your son, Donald? Daniel, yes. But I didn't realise it at the time. How do you know it was an accident? Did you see someone kill your child? Well, no, I didn't, but I heard something. You heard something? Yet you're not even worthy of calling yourself one. What are you gonna do? Hit me? Go on then. I've had worse. It's probably a good reason your kids were taken away from you. Punishment should be given to those who deserve it. What do you know about death? About murder? Not being able to... I don't blame you for not believing me. I've questioned my sanity countless times. Did I? No. I can't have. Go on. It's all right. I just wanted, I just wanted my life back. So I gave Trisha the one thing that would make our lives normal again. Another child. Those few years with Trisha and Courtney were the best years of my life. But then it all started again. Trisha had to go away for a week to look after her mum. bullied us every day and every night. <laughs> I knew what he was going to say before he even said it. Crime wasn't his thing. He was such a good kid. So what happened? I had one more night. One more night before Trisha came home. And I could then tell her everything. So I wouldn't be alone. So you left him alone? <laughs> I did what any other person would have done in this situation.
So, what happened when your wife came back? I found her dead this morning in Courtney's room. I haven't been back since. Worst bit is, I can't remember their faces. Not one single face. So did you see who did it? Black eyes. Look, I've told you what's happened. I need you to tell me it's not all in my mind. I sat under the pillar. Give it to me. I believe that's what you think happened in your heart, but that's the problem with being crazy. You don't realise you're crazy. I didn't kill my fucking family! This thing's gonna kill me, maybe even you! There's people that can help you, Chris. You don't get it! I'm gonna die! I'm not your enemy here, Chris! Just, just leave me! Just... <gasps> I believe you. Everything's gonna be all right, just you need to calm down. What if I did do it? What if 